Hello everyone and welcome in this tutorial. I'm going to show you how to make HTTP server with STM32 MCU. This video is separated into two parts. Part one for explanation creating HTTP server. Part two for creating HTTP server with AJAX. If you haven't seen my first video, that is show the configuration of ANC 28G60 to STM32. Uh, I am writing down link underneath the video. Please watch it first uh, before we start. For remember, I connect my MNC 28 g to STM32 uh, SBI1, BA5 for clock pin, BA7 for slave input pin, BA6 for slave output pin, BA4 for, A and, uh, for interrupt pin, and BC4 for ship select pin. Now we start. Generate Now I do what uh, I did in the last video exactly uh, Even TCB echo server handler I test it uh, by uh, command prompt Now let's see Then get Perfect it works now now uh, we go to Light web IBE folder Go to contrib section Choose apps Copy it Go to soft system workbench And paste it In source folder like this fresh the index file Make sure that the apps folder are not excluded. Yes, it is not. Exclude all folder except HTTP server underscore row. To save time in building. Now add the bus Go to properties Bus and include Workspace Choose HTTP server underscore row Apply Now build it I 
after this uh, go to light web IBE to apps HTTP server row and exclude make if is data exclude FC folder exclude fs data dot c build it now i got uh, this arrow uh, follow non static declaration to get out from this error copy light web uh, http str and str private and define it in light web iovt header file build it again We have the same error here. What is the wrong? Uh, I define it uh, one, but it's zero. Now build it again. Perfect. Now we gonna again HTTP initial. delete tcb server initial include header file httpd and build it debug the project test it bang to test it reset mcu i forget Now write down IBE and open chrome or any browser write down IBE address and click enter you could see the HTML uh, light web IBE default uh, on the contrib application NFS folder this HTML web page as you see now we are going to uh, go to the part uh, which we could uh, use Ajax method uh, to interact MCU with uh, HTTP server. Let's go and see.